Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, The Blood Samurai. My name is Sam and today we're back playing Genome Guardian. So yeah, this game is just kind of it. I, st I started off being like, you know what? I'm not going to talk much during my videos. But there's so much craziness that happens and we tried out the jester. I think we're going to go back to something a bit more um bit more normal <laughs> um so we'll go we'll go with that uh reactor yeah we'll go with that um <laughs> anything else spyglass v barrel light funnel to tell you what the perk does no, it does not. Okay. Interesting. Um. Anything? 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 What is it? Okay, so turret scale. I wish it would tell you kind of what that means, but it's fine. Um, so we're going to go with focus, and we're going to see probably what we can get. I think, um, I think there is a couple more weapons that I still need to discover. And, well, actually, more than just a couple. There's quite a few more weapons that I need to discover. But in terms of weapons that have bombs in them... Still have some more I need to discover. Apparently, for, for whatever reason, my aim is just really bad right now. So I want to get the CGTT. That's I think that's the next one that I want to get. Um, CG, and then okay, yeah, this is good. This is good. So we get the blast shotgun. So, Bubble Blaster is obviously, like, my personal favorite so far. But, I'm hoping eventually we can get something a little bit better. Or, at least similar, maybe? Because the, the strategy that I went for with the Bubble Blaster was really fun. And I want to do something like that again. I think that would be awesome if I could do that again. So, we're going to hope for the best. But it very well may end up being that the Bubble Blaster just is just the the better better choice i don't know <laughs> so yeah cgtt so i still need one more bomb and then we'll be in a good position Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. I really, I really love this game. This game is so easy for, like, recording. It's so easy for, like, it, or not easy, but, it, like, it's so easy for recording. It's so fun to play. Like, literally everything about this game just makes me want to keep playing it. So, game... The game developer, Alferior, appreciate him so much for sending me the game for free. Um, genuinely was so nice of him to do. And great, I really do appreciate it. Such a great game. Yeah, more wave time, I don't care. Bubble Burster. Slug that splits open to reveal three homing bubbles that damage micros over time. Could have guessed area-based damage and homing could combine so well. 
Uh. Oh. Oh, that's intriguing. That is, that is, that is quite the... It's, it's not quite the bubble blaster that I would like, but it's... It is, it is interesting. This is, this is an intriguing weapon. Definitely, bubble blaster is definitely my personal favorite, even with this, but... This is, this is definitely very cool. Very cool. Yeah, let's go for more size. Do I want to have sticky with it? Probably not. Yeah, this is... I feel like... I honestly do feel like less range would be better. And sticky wouldn't be good with this. But... Yeah, I do feel like less range would be really good with this. So it actually was really, I mean, okay. I need to get something that's gonna give it less range. There was something that gave it more damage and less range and I feel like I might want something like that. Damage while above. And I don't really want any of those things. I'm gonna try to save my rerolls for now, I think. At least until later on when I have some more money. Definitely do want more damage because it does struggle a little bit with dealing enough damage. Because I think it's only like five damage, right? The little like little guys here. Let me see, yeah, it's like five yeah, each they do like five damage. Now it is five damage over time, so they do shred like smaller units fairly quickly. It's, and then there are multiple of them, so that means that they do, um, like, they do, um, like, a good amount of damage to, uh, when you have them combined together. Um, this is very interesting. Definitely, I definitely could get to wave 30 with this. This is definitely a weapon I'm fairly confident with getting to wave 30 with. Like, I'm not worried at all with this. I feel like the extra wave time, if anything, helps me. Yes, it takes longer to get to the higher waves, but at the same time, I'm also going to be earning more biomass early on. Which is why I don't feel like the extra wave time is really that bad of a thing. Um... Oh, wow. <laughs> Holy crap. Less range and more and less speed is going to be insane. Yeah, more fire rate on this is also going to be crazy. I need more fire rate. We're going to go with the Bizian Hunters. Why not? We'll grab that. Uh, More range. Yeah, more fire rate. Jeez. 
you know what? This I might I might have to take back what I said about the bubble blaster. This might be my new favorite. This is so sick. I love this one. Oh yeah, give me that. 100% give me that. Um Oh, I wish I I wish that was for that, but yeah. Even has like a it makes like a nice beat. Uh, maybe just me, like just listening to it, it's just like a nice, nice beat. Yeah, it's just probably me. So, do these things have a limit to them, or do they just keep going? Because obviously, this thing has a limit to like its range. But I'm curious if these, if the homing bubbles have a limit to their range. I, obviously, I assume they would, because they or, or they do to deteriorate, deteriorate um, over time. Damage, less fire rate, more damage. I don't think that's that good. I already have one. I don't need another. More damage, less speed. With how, with how slow this thing already is. 50%. Why is the speed not being affected? Is it because I'm already reducing the speed so much? Is it just not even... It's not even like registering the speed anymore. Yeah, let's go with more damage. <laughs> this is so sick. <laughs> the reduced speed as well just makes it so that they cover more of the screen. I want more fire rate though. I know I already used up all of the little, like, slots and stuff, but I want more fire rate. I ne and I also don't want there to be, like, an open spot on the screen. Like, right there, there's a little, little open area right there. I want there to always... I want the screen to basically always be filled with this stuff. <laughs> this is... This is, oh, this is crazier than I could have ever expected. The thing, though, with the bubble blasters is that with the bubble blasters, you only really have to worry about the size, the area, the fire rate, and, like, maybe, like, the projectiles. But really, it's just the damage, fire rate, and size. But with this, you have to worry about speed, range, damage, fire rate. You have to, there's more aspects to this that come into play. So, let's say with like the bubble blaster, you get like some crazy range, some good fire rate, and some less than, le less than like, average damage it's not that bad because you have really good so as so basically what i'm trying to say is like you only have three characteristics to worry about that you can basically invest a ton into whereas with this it's like you have more characteristics that could even having like one bad one could make it pretty bad um I mean, damage isn't super important with this. I mean, it. 
Actually, damage is kind of important with this because uh, you need to worry about like the bigger guys because at some point the bigger guys are probably going to become tough enough to be able to basically like not have to worry about my me at all. So that's definitely something to worry about. Uh, don't need to worry about that at least right now, but I'm looking for some better turret mods because I don't really think those were all that good for this type of build. Like cooling rate, heat max. Heat max doesn't matter. Cooling rate doesn't matter when you don't have to worry about cooling and you don't have to worry about uh, losing heat. Um, or you don't you don't have to worry about really gaining much heat because you have the you lose heat per elimination. Um, so it's not too much to worry about there. You can literally like spin in a you can move you can turn 90 degrees 90 degrees 90 degrees 90 degrees and just basically spin in a circle kind of like that and then you don't have to worry about losing at all burn duration we don't have any burn the only problem is like the beginning part here because the fire rate is so low um and the speed is so slow and the range is decent ways away like with the slow speed it's actually like a decent distance that it does have to travel so you have to keep that in mind as well and that's also another part of it it's like you need to make sure that the speed is low but you also have to make the range make sure that the range is even lower so it's yeah Wait, i don't I don't think eliminate or random micro. I'd rather something something that's gonna buff this is basically what I'm after right now. I think I do still prefer the bubble blaster, but this is still fun to use. It's fun to fun to see how this goes. I'm enjoying this. If you could if you could set a program that makes it so that your cursor just like moves in 90 degrees every like second like you hold down left click move 90 degrees hold down left click move 90 degrees hold down left like if you could just do that you could i'm pretty sure go on forever like this to the point where i think i might get carpal tunnel from from doing this I'm just repeating the same action where I'm just moving in circles. I, I'm going to use my other hand and just kind of spin around a little bit. So my right hand is actually hurting from this. Because I'm literally just spinning in circles. That's right, Elfiria. You're going to have to pay for my medical bills. This is your fault, not my fault, your fault. And I live in America, so our medical bills, you know, you know, those are expensive. Ooh, that would have been good to have, but. Would have probably been better than that, but it's okay. Too late now. I also do like how the weapons like reflect the color of the genes that that are used to that like uh, to the genes that they're composed of. I feel like that's pretty cool. Plus one health per elimination. Yeah, I'm not really getting 
Anything that's like super beneficial to me. Don't have to worry about projectiles. The fast units are only really are only kind of dangerous during the beginning. Later, the later stage is when you get like when it becomes a little bit more dangerous with like the bigger guys because obviously you have like a more AOE based build. But at the same time, it's not that big of a deal. I think I'm. I think I would like a. Do, do they? Is there like a two times speed? Uh. Let's see by doubling its size. Uh, da, da, da. Um. Okay. Well, there is no two times speed, but that would be, I feel like. Into, that would, I feel like that would be nice to have um, right now because uh, I don't know if anyone is anyone if anyone's noticing but things are kind of moving a little slow at the moment Especially when you're kind of just doing the same thing over and over again. There's probably a build out there where you can just sit, like, like hold left click and do nothing. There's definitely, like, a build out there like that. Um, oh, I unlocked the demon. Shots fired at... The thing is, I'm eliminating stuff very quickly. Let's, let's see how this goes. Oh. Oh my gosh, it's like a permanent plus 50% fire rate. Basically. Not quite permanent, but very close. There's very little downtime. This is so much better. Okay. I forgot that there's no shop. Oh, great. Just what I needed. Triple biomass. Because I definitely need more biomass. Uh, gosh. This is fun. This is, I mean, I'm, I'm enjoying just, 
like it's very casual this this run this type of build is very casual you don't really have to do much you can just like i said go in circles spin move your cursor in a circle and you're gonna win this is the one of the most like idle type builds i've ever experienced so far again there's probably something stronger than this that is even more idle like where you could just kind of sit back and not have to really do much but so far this has been very very interesting Anyone else just kind of feeling relaxed? Seeing just like the, the yellow, blue, green just kind of fill the screen? Anyone else just feel really relaxed right now just watching this? Does anyone else find this very calming or is it just me? Wave 29. One more wave and I hit wave 30 and then I reach depth 2. And I have barely had to do anything at all. I'm also curious what the demon turret does. That music is never gonna... Or that sound effect, not music, but that sound effect is never not gonna be, like, creepy. It really does sound like something out of the back rooms. Tell me I'm wrong. Tell me I'm wrong. This is just so peaceful. I love how like we go from like the jester, which is like, is like the most chaotic thing I've ever seen. And now we get into, um, then we get into that one, which was like extremely calming. Made a deal with the devil. The first hit on the micro has Plus 20% burn chance, destroyed and hit or damage, regardless of health and shield. Oh. So you just... So you just die. If you get hit. Okay. Cool, cool, okay. Cooling rate, cooling delay. Re where is it? Funnel? Give me some more. What did I... What was I using before? Cooling delay. I'm gonna get rid of that. I'm gonna go with that. And then... Okay. Um... I wanna... Do want to find out what that does? Turret cursor. Eight. Jeez, with all the cosmetics as well, that that's that's pretty cool. Uh, I like that. I, I like all the. I like that they have cosmetics and stuff as well in this. this is, that's pretty cool. Um. But yeah, 
hope you guys enjoyed today's video of Genome Guardian. If you did, uh, please leave a like on and subscribe to the channel. It mean the world to me. It doesn't cost you guys anything. And, um, and yeah, I'm glad we found another kind of strategy. Again, Bubble Blaster might still be my favorite, but that one is definitely a close second. Um, yeah, the Bubble Burster. Bubble Blaster and Bubble Burster. Both to do with bubbles. I, you know what? It seems like the bubbles are just reigning supreme. Um, so... We're going to have to try out some other things, I think, at some point. But, yeah, these two were definitely, definitely my favorites. So, um, at least so far. But, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave it. Like, I already, I already mentioned this. If you liked the video, please leave a, leave, 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 blah, 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 blah. Leave a like on it and subscribe to the channel. It means the world to me. It doesn't cost you guys anything. And, um, yeah, I hope to see you guys in the next one. You guys take care. What does this button do? Oh, okay, that's what it does. You guys take care.